Hello again. Today I'm going to be reviewing yet another flavor of Dr. Pepper, as you could not have already guessed. Today's flavor is Dr. Pepper made with real sugar. That's right, real sugar. None of that high fructose corn syrup stuff. So this can was released in 2010 to celebrate the 125th anniversary of Dr. Pepper. Um, it also used one of the, the old logos from, I believe, the 1960s, where they were, you know, the, the slogan was drink a bite to eat, you know, always drink a Dr. Pepper at 10, 2, and 4, three most important times of the day between your meals when you're running low on sugar. This was uh, the pick me up to get you through the work day and still pick me up today, depending on where you are and what you do. So let's go ahead and crack this one open, take a sip and see what it has to offer. Oh yes, um, that's that's definitely got to be cane sugar of some sorts. It's delicious. I I love it. Now I drink a ton of Dr Pepper during the day on my own, but I probably wouldn't be doing that with these because they're extremely sweet. There's there's a definite difference in the the sweetness of that sugar. Uh, that's that's the real stuff. So probably need to to pace this out amongst the other original twenty three flavor can. But I'm a huge fan. I give this ten thumbs up. However many I've got, ten, two, and four, I guess. Um, on that note, Dr. Pepper Day is October 24th, 10 to 4, as one might have been able to deduce, but that's the day. Drink a Dr. Pepper, save one if you can, get your hands on one of these if you can. I have to drive a bit to find one in my area, but uh, it's, it's well worth it. So thanks for watching and hope you have a good one and see you next time.